Hey everyone, welcome back for part two of Making of the Military Plaques for Promotion Season. If you didn't catch the first part, I've linked to it in the description of the video. Originally, I was going to make three parts to this series, but I was able to condense it down to two parts. In this part, I'm carving the plaque for the United States Marine Corps Gunnery Sergeant and creating a larger plaque for the guest speaker of the Khaki Ball here in Southern California. All the plaques are approximately 14 inches high and 20 inches long. For the gunnery sergeant plaque, I did the same technique as I did for the sergeant first class plaque that you saw in part one. I did a V carve of the rank insignia and used a wide enough area to give room to engrave the uh, CPO creed on the right hand side using the laser later on. If you're enjoying the video, please don't forget to like and subscribe and leave your comments in the comment section. The V-carve for the Gunny Sergeant plaque was done in three parts. First with a one quarter inch bit, then a one eighth inch bit, and then finally with a 10.5 degree uh, tapered ball nose bit configured as a V-bit. The final part of the Gunnery Sergeant plaque was to do the laser burn of the creed and name and date. I do realize that I got the date with an extra number. It says 2020 and then a 4. This was corrected later off camera. The guest speaker's plaque features an American flag with the scene of the flag raising at Iwo Jima. It goes about an inch deep at its deepest point, and this card took about 14 hours total using a quarter inch bit and a one eighth inch If you're enjoying the video, please don't forget to like and subscribe and leave your comments in the comment section.
The final step for the guest speaker plaque was to engrave using a 15 degree V bit the name, rank, and to commemorate the ceremony. We've done this on uh, stripes of the American flag. Originally, I aura masked this because I intended to uh, airbrush this with a gold paint, but at the last minute, the customer decided that they wanted just the engraving. Okay, so in total I made uh, six plaques. I made one in walnut with the Iwo Jima on the American flag for the Master of Ceremonies. Then there was one gunny sergeant promoted, one sergeant first class for the army, and four Navy chief petty officers. So here's basic display of each, and we'll go in for some close-up shots as well. Okay, so for the finishes, on the walnut I used Odie's oil, the uh, universal oil. And for the maple plaques, I used the walrus furniture oil, which got just a nice matte finish, but pops the wood just a little bit. Gives pretty decent color. Congratulations to this year's selectee, Logical Technician Collection Chief Petty Officer, Dusan Kozik. Information Systems Technician Chief Petty Officer, Edward Flores. Information Systems Technician Chief Petty Officer, Joshua Santiago. Gunny Sergeant, Miguel Tavares. And Sergeant First Class, April Thomas. Congratulations to all of the selectees.